hey guys it's chica here again and you're welcome back to my channel how are you doing hope you are doing great so guys in this video i am going to recreate this kaftan gown yeah i'm going to recreate this kaftan gown so watch as i do it so i folded the material into two pieces two places okay and i folded it so that it can reach the size of the one i already had and i bring out one i brought out one piece for the back because i'm cutting out for the back first and i cut out the salvage end of the material that i'm going to use then i went down by one inch for the back neck depth and went in by 2.5 inch for the width of the neckline so i'm going to go down by two inches for the shoulder slope deck connect it to the neck width then i cut it out so this is for the back we are done so for the front we are going to do the same thing but the neck depth is going to be different from the back neck depth so we did the same thing well the neck depth i am going to go down by 9.5 to 10 inches would be nice so but let's check before we do that i am going to use the neck depth for the um the already made one we're going to check the neck depth for the neck already made one so here i'm trying to check out the neck depth and it's nine inches nine inches it's up to eight to nine inches so i'm marking nine and a half inches for it then went in by 2.5 inches for the neck width and i connect it to the 9.5 inch then the shoulder slope 2.5 2 inches and connect it to the neck width then i'm going to cut it out right now guys we are done so it's time to go fix it so guys here we are on the table trying to fix the neckline and i'm going to still um, interface the neckline with a bias tape with a bias tape and i'll fold it in like this when i'm done stitching it and i will and i will stitch it down i will do the same for the neck for the neckline and once i'm done stitching it it will look like this and next I'll, i'm going to join the two shoulders together i'm going to join the shoulders together and that is it i'll join it this way and i'll do the same for the other side and i'll be right back so guys here we are done stitching the neckline and i joined the shoulders as well and also uh, join hemmed the sides the size of the gown this is how i hemmed it very simple to make and also the down part i hemmed it all round this is how it looks like so i'm going to teach you how how i'm going to um stitch the sides of the gown this is the final part of the gown okay it's very simple to make so after arranging your gown the next thing you're going to do is to go in by five inches from here i'm going to do it i'm doing it at the wrong side of the on the wrong side of the material because i want to mark it exactly the way i want it to be i don't want uh, the front line to have chalk marks on it okay so that is why i'm using the wrong side i don't want the right side of the uh, material the gown to have a chalk mark on it but i hope you use this side to understand because we are going to be stitching on the right side directly and not on the wrong side so don't 
do anything don't stitch yet on the wrong side until you watch this video to the end before you do your own okay so i am going to go in by five inches from the shoulder down to the full length of the gown this is that's what i'm doing right here so I'm, I'm going to go in by five inches all the way to the down part of the gown and once i am done i'm going to do the same on the other side of the gown so i'm going to go up by from the down i'm going to create a, a um, slit by 20 inches from the down part i came up by 20 inches going to be the opening of the gown so it can allow you to walk very freely you understand so then on the upper area we are going to create the sleeve i went down by 11 inches for the sleeve from the shoulder line i went down by 11 inches and that is it so i'm going to stitch from that 11 inches down to the to 37 inches point you understand so i'm going to stitch from 11 inches down to um, 37 inches point so from here to here that is the only place i'm going to stitch then i'll be right back so this is the front side so this is where we are going to be stitching so i want to explain it very well this is where we're going to be stitching as you can see go down by 11 inch 5 5 inches up the way to the down then start sewing from 11 inches and stop at that seven inches you can see i went up by 20 inches for the slit that is the side opening of the gown okay so i'm going to sew from here to this place from here to this place directly like this just like this and here is how it what it looks like okay this is what it looks like this is the scarf i created a scarf for it you know that gun used to have scarf it has scarf so this is the short scarf i created for it 